Ursuline grad Mark Hughes made his professional basketball dream a reality this past year, playing in England. The pandemic cut his rookie season short, so he's now back home in Youngstown and officially a free agent. He's been training and staying in shape the past couple months, waiting for the next chapter of his career to unfold. Mark Hughes has always been competitive. After all, he's the third youngest of eight siblings. Coming from just how competitive everyone is, it was always it was always something to deal with in the house. Everyone's trying to win, so that definitely nurtured my competitive edge. A 2015 Ursuline grad, Mark was an all-state player for the Irish, turned all-conference performer at Wright State. Last summer, he signed a one-year contract to play for the Worcester Wolves in the British Basketball League. Uh, once I found my groove at East Level, playing, uh, things start to go well for me. I just had to settle in and play basketball. Mark started as a rookie for the Wolves, helping his team win a cup championship back in January. The pandemic ended their season in March, and after taking about a month off, Mark is back in the gym working with local trainers such as Anthony Pugh. We got all the downtime in the world right now, so I feel like, how can you take care of your body right now? This is the best time to do it. Uh, you can get in the gym by yourself and work on the things that you need to improve on from last year and uh, staying strong is something that's always going to be key for a professional basketball player just because of the level you're playing at. Basketball has taken Hughes around the world. He also got a chance to play in China last summer. His goal is to play at the highest level possible, whether that takes him back to the BBL or elsewhere. He graduated from Wright State with an exercise science degree and hopes to become a strength and conditioning coach after his playing days are over. I want to play basketball for as long as I can, but at the same time, I know the the ball stops bouncing eventually and life's full full of setbacks and, and nothing's ever going to go perfect but I feel like as long as you keep your head down and you're working hard and things will always work out for you a lot of pride in being from Youngstown so just be something positive coming out of this city is uh, it means a lot to me.